dobry, welcome to Tuesday, which in Polish is... Wtorek. Isabella is there, and we are on the way. We're going to go to Bath and Body Works because they have sale. And I am eating candy, sorry, delicious. But they have a sale for uh, the wallflowers, the, the, the scents. Uh, buy three, get three for free. And I have four washrooms, so that makes a big of a difference. So let's go, we'll take you with us and uh, show you around what's the Easter stuff. I'm really curious. So we'll have a look and then, uh, yeah, that's the beginning of the vlog today. You say hi, miss. Hi, <laughs> see ya guys. Such a happy day, I'm singing a song in such a happy way. Come on, sing along. It's undeniable how a smile can change your view. So put a great big smile on you. Uh, we getting terrible mess with the carpet, please. No, no, don't scare her. Don't scare her, Isabella. Please play nice. It's barking and it's scaring her. Yeah. Who's that? Who's that? Too fast. <laughs> Come closer slowly, slowly. She's hiding behind me. No, don't scare her. Just let her sniff. Ouch. Lilushki. That's yours, yes. Good morning, good morning, dzień dobry. Welcome to Wednesday, which in Polish is Środa. And me and Miss Isabella, I don't know if you can see her there, we're going to the dermatologist. Oh, and that's why it's traffic, it's a police car. She got a puppy. You guys saw, I, uh, I filmed it a tiny bit, uh, how Lilo like her little puppy <laughs> mm. but it stopped barking right yeah we got it off amazon it was 29.99 or something actually isabella Lily spent her mon money she has a wet nose and she touching. oh you think the wet nose make the puppy stop because barking she was touching the head with her wet nose and i think it got it absorbed in the fur and then got to the batteries oh i don't i don't think so because the batteries are on the bottom and when I opened the clothes, it started working again. I think uh, he's a quiet dog, just like Lilo, you know? She doesn't bark too much. Yeah. Anyhow, on the way... She barks at stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, she, she mostly barks at Sebastian. And when she barks at Sebastian, it's a real bark. <laughs> and she growls at the people outside the house. If she doesn't like someone or something, she doesn't like something. She growls, but she doesn't bark, so I don't know. Anyhow, with that being said, we're going to dermatologist and then we're going for going back to school. I have my coffee, you guys. Uh, I have to bake my bread again because I have like two slices left. And what else do I have to do today? I am not sure actually. Oh, I processed the recipe, but I didn't like the picture uh, for the recipe. So I don't know, um, I don't know if I'm going, because I have to do the cream cheese again and I might 
might attempt to make a picture, uh, take the picture again. So I might make the cream cheese, the horseradish cream cheese again, and then take a nicer picture because uh, I was filming at night and then I didn't set up my lights or anything, and I am not liking the thumbnail. So. I'm guessing I will uh, I will do that today. So I will redo I will do the the cream cheese again because we love it, and then I will take a picture. So that's the plan. The recipe dough is processed. So if I will make a nice uh, thumbnail, I will um, I will uh, uh, post it tonight, you guys. So uh, we'll keep you updated for now. Let's have a coffee drive in the traffic. Usually it was not such a bad traffic, but right now it's a little bit cuckoo. So, but we have time because it's 9.12 and we need if the puppy is flying. It's 9.12 and we need to be there at 10. So we have more than enough time. Anyhow, we went to Bath and Body Works yesterday. You saw, I picked up, um, what did I pick up? I picked up soaps. They had five for 25 and I picked up the wallflowers. They usually $8 each, but they were by three, uh, get three for free. So you got six for 24. So it's like four bucks one, so it's not bad. They also have, um, they also have a sale, but only today for the sprays, but I never use them. And I don't know if I wanna go um, especially to check. So, but they are like 325 per spray. But I don't know, because I think they are the, the healthy sprays, you know, they're not like the aerosol ones, uh, not sure. But I don't think we'll be driving there today. So next time when I go, I will pick up one to figure out if I like it. And then if I like it, uh, I might wait for another sale or something. Anyhow, let's drive. Uh, let's enjoy the sunshine, though it is cold. It's two degrees, feels like minus something. So not the spring yet, but the sunshine is nice. See you later, guys. Hello everybody, so I'm back home. I don't know, just uh, just a little bit of a low mood, I guess, today. <sighs> yeah, I'm guessing I'm worrying for tomorrow, I just don't realize that, because there is nothing to worry about until tomorrow, but anyhow. Um, so, not the best of the mood, so that's why I didn't talk to you guys. But now I realize I'm putting this in the... Hi, Lilo. <laughs> I'm putting this in the air fryer and I wanted to show you what I did. Those are, I'm trying to make um, uh, cheese crisps. So I have some mozzarella cheese with mixed with a little bit of fried onion, a little bit of garlic, uh, cheese obviously, and a little bit of egg whites. And now I have no idea how long to bake it, so I will uh, wing it, swing it, whatever, and we'll see how it goes. But uh, they smell delicious. Well, they smell like garlic and cheese. What can be wrong with cheese? and garlic nothing oh wow you could not see me there so anyhow i wanted to share it with you too, so i'll show you how this is going to come out let's put it for 10 minutes at 350 and uh, and we'll see if we will like i will be picking in before so i don't burn them but i want them to be crisps uh but like puffy crisp that's why i added uh, egg whites but i did not whip the egg whites so if they are not what I'm thinking that I want them to be next time I might actually make uh, egg whites to stiff peaks and then add the spices and the cheese and make them like cheese puffs I don't know I just felt like I want some cheese here you go anyhow I will close the doors right now because Missy got in and left the doors open and it's cold it's it's nice and sunny but it's like uh, zero degrees so Oh, I just locked the door, but she was outside. But that's okay. She will let me know if she wants to go in. Let's see. She wants to go in and she... Yeah, can you hear? Okay, so she didn't realize. I will close the door. Okay, hi, Missy. Daddy put boots on your carpet. Sit on your carpet so mommy can give you a treat. Yeah. So I'm always keeping her on the carpet there behind. So at least her paws are getting a little bit drier. And while she's waiting, I'm giving her a treat. So that was a chicken tr treat from the uh, from Costco. Ah, and I wanted to let you guys know, we tried the other one, the chewy one, this one, also from Costco. She doesn't like it. So I have a big bag of... I keep trying to give her, but she's just going with it and drops it somewhere. So the other one she doesn't like. She likes only the... 
She likes only the the chicken jerky, and I'm giving her the European uh, winners. So for a very good uh, uh, treat, I I usually when I make myself one. Uh, today I had one for lunch. The other one I made for her, and I'm going to cut it into pieces, and that's a treat for her as well. Uh, it doesn't have too many spices. It's not spicy or anything, so it's fine. Uh, and anyhow, uh, we'll see my cheese, and I will let you know when it's ready. And uh, I think I might be need another coffee. I think my mom will call soon. No, not yet, because <laughs> they didn't change time. It's so confusing. We change time here in Canada, but they didn't change time. The the uh, in uh, in Europe yet. They're going to change this. Saturday so but we already changed like what two three weeks ago <laughs> so we are confusing each other because we are used to always that okay at my uh, three is nine but right now at my three is eight there so ah uh, it's confused anyways you guys I'll go now um, if anything I will know I want to show you the the crisps and then uh, and then maybe and then I'll probably see you tomorrow after the appointment will let you know what's up but for now, let's go, let's have some cheese, yes. Okay, so uh, they look very weird. <laughs> Can I show you? They, it's almost done, but uh, they did puff up. Can you see them, guys? Um, yeah. Be I, it's, it's because of the egg whites, but now in the meantime, while I was waiting for this, I did something else. I took a teaspoon and then I have my grated Parmesan and uh, I will let her out. I took a teaspoon of Parmesan, he's here, and I put it in my, oh, actually that was two, because it's more than that, it was more than that. So, two teaspoons of cheese. Yeah, that's how much it was. So two teaspoons, and then I pop it in the microwave, and I tr first put for one minute, it was not um, long enough, it was not crisp enough. Then I add, no, 45 seconds, then a minute, then minute 15. And minute 15 was perfect, so right now we'll put for minute 15 and we'll see. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. <laughs> Alrighty, let me, I'm sorry, puppy, I'm sorry. I was talking here to my friends. <laughs> Anyhow, so... Um, it came out like this. I don't like the cheddar. I don't like the Parmesan crisps. So the, you can buy Parmesan crisps at Costco. And most people like them very much. For me, they are too salty. And uh, you know, and you have to be worried about the, uh, about the calories as well, but that's another story. But with this one, because it's done from um, uh, mozzarella, it's not too, 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 too sweet. It's not too salty. It's actually very delicious. I like it. So those puff ones are looking funny. So I don't know how that will fly. I think we can take them out right now. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's take one out. Okay. I don't know. Will it come? Oh, it comes out. Oh, but it's funny. Uh, I need to let it cool to see if it's going to crisp up. And by the way, those are the uh, parchment cups, uh, paper cups for the muffins. Um, I did have them. I never used them. I bought them for some idea and then I never used them. And right now for the cheese, because everyone says you need to use it, you need to make it on the parchment paper, paper because this is the only way it will not stick. So uh, here we go. It's sizzling. You guys see? Okay, so the other one, because I was making breaks, it didn't come that dark, but it's not, it's not burnt. It looks good. Oh, it smells so good, but let's try first the puffy one. So it's a little bit soft here and a little bit crispy on the top. Mm, no, I mean, it's okay, but, but I don't like the softness the egg white gave. This one, on the other hand, which is looking like this, two teaspoons in the cup, and uh, that's the color you get it when you put it for one minute and 15 seconds, and I like it. And this, you listen. Delicious. Okay, no egg white. I don't like it, and I don't like the spices either. I mean, okay, comparing to this, this is lovely and so simple mm, okay this is perfect two teaspoons of uh, grated 
I might add a little bit of Parmesan to it, but that was great at uh, mozzarella cheese. With, uh, with probably if I add a little bit of Parmesan, it will give a little bit more of character, but this is delicious. Minute 15 seconds in the microwave, in a parchment paper cup or on the parchment paper, then it's not going to be so perfectly round. Those are perfectly round because they are in the parchment paper cups. Oh yeah, and you know what? You, I showed you the bags I was trying, yeah? The moon cheese, when you buy it, it's like $5 per little bag. And then you can find them a little bit cheaper at HomeSense. Camila bought for me $2.99, but it's still $2.99 for a small bag. This, at Costco, the cheese I'm buying, it's 2.2 kilos, $20. 2.2 kilos, you know how many of these I could make? Anyhow. A little bit better mood with having some cheese and I will see you guys later. Hello everybody. If you can see me, I'll keep the clip. If you cannot see me, I'm sorry. I don't know if you can. But anyhow, uh, we're going to Walmart and uh, we just had a train passing. And it just reminded me of uh, holidays when I was, uh, I think Sebastian's age actually. And my parents would be taking me and uh, my uh, cousins. And we would be going from Warsaw to the mountains and we would be taking the train, but like overnight. And uh, it was like with the bunk beds and stuff and the sound of the wheels of the train. It was just like a flashback. I don't know. It was. It was. It made me feel so good. I'm like, I want to go on a holiday with the train and in the bunk bed. And I don't think my kids would mind. So no, I actually. <laughs> I don't know. I love the feeling of being able to have like, kind of like a hotel on the move, like on a plane. Uh, no, no, on a, on a train. Yeah. Like if we have a bed. Yeah, no, now you guys can see me. I don't think you could see me before. And then you open the window, you hear. Yeah, actually, I'm, I'm having uh, uh, Alexa um, playing me rain sounds for me and Isabella to fall asleep. Now I wish, I'm actually going to find out if she has the train sounds because I think I would prefer the train what sounds. What step ahead of you? Huh? I already have it installed on Alexa. What do you have? I have it on my at night. The train sounds? Yeah, just say Alexa play train sounds and then she starts oh my goodness I'm going to do that and it will make me feel like I'm a teenager again and I'm going to the mountains for a for holiday I don't know if it was train sounds or subway sounds okay well but it's the same it's the wheels yeah. on the on the train just tracks just try both if she doesn't know what train sounds to say subway sounds okay I'll do that I'll and do it has that the tonight. horn honking every time to time uh huh it's probably they just recorded the train yeah yeah but it's cool. All right, I need to turn off the lights. So now you don't see me. Now you see me. Now you don't. <laughs> Anyhow, see you guys later. Let's go Walmart. Hello, everybody. Dzień dobry. Welcome to Thursday, which in Polish is Czwartek. And I just took Lilo for a walk and we are in the park. I'm sitting down a little bit, letting her pee right now <laughs> but uh, I've been to Toronto today to see the doctor I didn't vlog anything because first of all I was nervous and second of all it was raining and yucky I don't know if the rain is coming here probably it is but not yet but anyhow so we don't know much more <laughs> uh, I just need more tests so I was sent for the blood test which I did today and then uh, I hope the wind doesn't bother us so we'll see uh, so for the blood test and I need to have a CAT scan done so they will send me in the next two weeks an appointment for the CAT scan and then we'll go to the specialist again and then we'll find out some more do they need to remove it do they don't need to remove it what's happening so uh, that's the update on this basically we don't know much more <laughs> So that's what it is and today I'm hoping to bake my bread but for now I just came back I ate I took uh, poopy <laughs> I took Lilo for a walk and uh, then I need to pick up kids and I don't know there is homework no homework what's happening so we'll figure out but definitely I would like to bake my bread because I don't have it for a few days and I don't like not having my bread and I also received uh, another uh, uh, quest chips so I wanted to uh, try those out with you so hopefully I will remember later in the uh, afternoon to uh, to film it for you. 
Uh, I did the recipe yesterday and I really like the cream cheese so she just took herself off the leash sorry I, I grabbed it she's on the leash now but the leash got untied from the bench anyhow so uh, that's what's happening uh, my dear friends uh, I'm still nervous whatever but <laughs> what can you do you cannot do what you cannot do right so let's worry a little bit longer and see what's happening now uh, we we talked with uh, with Katalin because Katalin took go went with me. It was so nice. I really uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, he drove me there. He stayed with me, and then he drove me back. So um, I'm I'm very happy. I had the support. And uh, I uh, while we were driving because it's a little bit of a drive, we talked and we decided that we'll be moving furniture a little bit around the house. So uh, hopefully maybe we can start doing some some today. But I don't know if he will have time because it's uh, it's the middle of the week. So he has a lot of work and he did take the morning off so we'll see but I'm excited about it and obviously you guys are going to see because the the lunch I'm usually sitting on uh, while I'm working with my laptop or watching YouTube uh, it's destroyed it's like it's collapsed and uh, the leather it's not a real leather uh, started coming off so um, kind of needs a replacement and I sit there the most so I would like to be able to have a nice comfortable sitting there that I would be able to sit with Sebastian the kids come and cuddle with me I can put my laptop aside and then you know have a moment with my kids so uh, uh, we're going to move uh, sofas around the house we'll see how that will work and obviously I'll show you how it went but I don't know if it's going to happen in this vlog I would like that but I don't know if Catalina will have time uh, and uh, if not, then uh, then probably over the weekend. So it would be probably I would show you in the next vlog. Okay, enough talking. So that's what's up with me. Uh, right now I'm going to be uh, walking more with Lilu, and then um, I will see you. Uh, I will see you later. I'm not sure with what, but but this one needs a walk. So let's go. See you later, guys. Everybody, Jane Dobry, welcome to Saturday, which in Polish is Sobota. And Katrin just went to pick up kids back from the music. Uh, no big plans, it's pouring rain outside, and I'm feeling very tired. <laughs> so, uh, no, no big plans. But with that being said, I am going to try. Uh, to make my feta cheese again because we finished the one I had and right now I have the ingredients which they told me so I had it before but not everything I didn't have the calcium chloride I don't think you can see it calcium chloride which they said is re it's needed and they are saying for wine beer and cheese making add up to one teaspoon per five gallons it lowers pH and um, something yeah so anyhow so that's what I have right now which I needed I do have the rennet tablets which I need a quarter of one and then I, I have a citric acid and I'm going to be using my milk and we'll see how that will fly I want to do it because I cooked already I put it in the fridge uh, pasta and rice which means I don't need a pressure cooker for now and uh, I'm, I'm freezing some burgers to make cotletti milone so I have like the burger patties from uh, Costco and I'm just unfreezing them and then I will add some onion and some egg and just fry them as not really burgers, cotletti milone. That's what it is. Anyhow, so that's the plan. And I also wanted to show you guys something I ordered uh, on Amazon. I needed, my back is hurting. So I told you it's not kidneys, the doctor said. Um, hold the thought. Okay, I'm back. So uh, he told me it's a back issue, so I should take care of my back. But I picked up myself icy hot patches for the back and I am going to put it in a moment because it hurts. But with that being said, when I ordered this, I wanted to have it de delivered the next day and I started browsing, browsing what I would like to add. And for very long time, I was looking for um, kind of olive green uh, makeup. It I do believe it fits with my eyes. I do not like anything uh, blue. So I only use browns, but browns mixed with greens, it's a nice combination. And I picked up this Marcel uh, little palette and I just got it. That's how it looks like, you guys. It was 12 bucks. If I open it, I don't know if you guys are going to be seeing it better. Let's see. 
that's how it looks like and I really like it. You know guys me already, I'm guessing. Not much makeup. But you see, this is, right now, it's a makeup from this. I put the darkest one under and next to my lash line. And then I put the light olive one on my lid. I don't know. Looks good. I like it. It, it spreads, spreads. I don't know. You, you apply it very nicely. I, uh, I really like it. So... That's what I wanted to show you guys. And really, I think 12 bucks. And it, it's really all the nice colors I really, really like. So with that being said, I have a patch for my back. I have makeup on my eyes and I'm half pages. But because it was delivered right now, I had to try it out, no? So I did. And right now, I think I want to do the... i also making yogurt. It's already in the fridge. I um, made it. So I used my cultures and they didn't work again. So I... Asked Camila yesterday because she was in the store if she can pick me up a small tub of uh, yogurt, which she did. It was like a set of four and I used one and it worked. And the other three I froze because I was told that on YouTube videos that if you freeze your yogurt, then you just unfreeze it the day before and it will w work for making the yogurt again. We'll see. I froze the other three tubs for the next time and we'll see. I do like the flavor better. It's less bitter. So... It was about the starters, making the uh, yogurt a little bit more bitter that I like. Not really my process, it seems, because I added this one. Pr process was the same. The yogurt is not so bitter. And right now it's draining to make it thick. So that's what it is. And right now we'll try to do the feta cheese. And I did it once and it worked. And hopefully, hopefully, I actually wrote it down because... I keep forgetting if I don't write it down. Feta cheese. Okay, I have. For, so I have one and a half liters of milk, quarter cup of citric acid, not cup, quarter teaspoon of citric acid, quarter teaspoon of calcium chloride, and half a tablet of rennet. And that's what I have here. And then uh, I put it on yogurt setting, wait until it warms up for 10 minutes. I'll all the ingredients stir. Let's stand for one hour. And then cut the curds and let it rest for 15 minutes. Stir the curds until little. Let it set for 15 minutes. Put it in a cheese mold and press. And I do have that cheese mold. I wanted to, uh, you know, guys, because uh, I bought it. Should I show you? Uh, this one. So we're going to try to use this one uh, for feta. And then that should all happen today. Let it set for 24 hours. Okay. So 24 hours in this and then 24 hours in a brine before it's okay to eat. Uh, okay, well, I'll start the process today. That's what I'm planning. And yeah, I can hear the birds and it's raining. Anyhow, I will see you guys uh, later. Let's, uh, let's do some cheese. They say it's a matter of time A thousand days and the sun won't shine before I come back to you When I'm happy Nothing's going to stop me I'm making my way home I'm making my way For your love I will go far I wanna be wherever you are I know I'm coming back for you Hello everybody, a little bit of update on today. So um, the kids came back from music and I am making waffles. I have to make my waffles. So you know the recipe, so I have my butter. Some, actually I should pick it, pick in if I'm not burning them. No, perfect, not yet. Okay, I'm also making cotlette mielone. I told you guys I am not feeling good. I don't know what's up, but I'm not feeling good. Here I have cotlette mielone, meaning meat with eggs, spices and onion and here we have nice potatoes roasting for another 10 minutes and I have steam steaming uh, broccoli in the microwave actually I steamed already half and I have here another half to steam and this I wanted to tell you guys so uh, the cheese uh, progress let's have a look i need a knife because we'll be cutting the curds that's what they said cut the curds and let them set so let's cut the curds because i i sh shook it already 
Oh, it says my waffles are ready, but they too pale. So we don't worry about that. Let's have a look at my cheese. So I'm going to take the cover. Let's have a look. Um, all right. So if you have a look, look, it's, it's set. It's stiff whatever you say so we want a cubes kind of okay so we go through and we cut I don't know how good of a job we're making but that's what we supposed to do and then the other way around as well okay you can see the little cubes but right now after we cut we supposed to let it be for another I do believe 10 minutes, so, okay. Cut, let it set, so let's cover it back. Don't have flies yet, but who knows. Okay, so we let the curd set, and then we stir it, I guess, and then we'll be straining it. Anyhow, in the meantime, I'm burning my uh, my waffles, I'm making potatoes in the dinner, and then after I'm done with this, I'm going to crush. I really, I don't know what's up. I hope I'm not getting sick again. Now it, it would be like unacceptable. But I just don't feel good. I don't know. Not my day. I hate the weather too. It's like pouring rain and it's gray and it's cold. And the waffles smell good. Maybe they're good already. Let's see. Okay. Yes. That looks good. Okay. I'll have some waffles. Obviously, those are keto waffles. Yes, you guys know. Anyhow, I'll go now. And I will see you later. All right, let's have a look. So the dinner is ready. I showed you. I have the potatoes and everything ready. I'm so ready to lay down, I have to say. But I want to stir the curds and I wanted to show you. So let's... Uh, one, two, three. Okay. Here we go. So they say gently. Okay. Gently. So is it gently? By the way, the pressure uh, cooker is turned off right now. Yes. I'm not. Uh, I'm not. Uh, they are looking interesting. <laughs> I'm not having it on. So it's no more keeping temperature. It's just room temperature. So they say uh, mix it until they get to small pieces. Now it's say. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right, and now let it set for 15 minutes again. So let's cover back. Let's let the hound out. Say hi, 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 ring the bell, ring the bell, ring the bell. Ah, she did already, so. Ah, oh, terrible weather. It is late. It's very late, so it's time to go to sleep. I'm looking funny because I have henna on. I am, uh, yeah, I had a lot of grace. I had to get rid of it. So, uh, yeah, so Saturday is over. The vlog is over. I just wanted to tell you I have the feta in the fridge. I am excited about it. We'll see. Uh, it, I added, uh, let me show you. So in this box, if I take the, the cover, and now I have a little um, bag with my wooden blocks so I can push the cheese and it's pushing it. And right now actually I'm going to push it on the other side, I can see, because on the sides it's uh, close with the uh, cheesecloth. 
yeah so right now I push it more on this side because it was not there and then when I'm closing this it puts a pressure and I'm guessing the cheese will harden we'll see you guys will know in the next vlog but for now um, it stays like this so they say 24 hours and then after 24 hours I'll make the brine and then uh, it needs to stay another 24 hours in the salt and then it's ready to eat so we'll see how it, that's going to work but that's going to be next weekend right now I'm going to go to sleep so I wanted to say thank you so much for watching you guys I hope you enjoyed it and if you did please give me a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already I would love to have you on board and I will see you guys soon bye